program started because, like I said, San Diego needed something that um, that the churches didn't come up with. Uh, community members, they didn't know what to do about the police shootings and everything. So, you know, I mean, I came up with the, uh, with the Unity Games. Five years running, and this is what you get, you know? Dedicated people that are trying to do something to better their community. That's what this is about. Nothing more, no, uh, nothing less. This is our fifth annual Unity Games, sponsored by Say San Diego, where we have uh, multiple nonprofit organizations that are serving the community. Uh, we have churches, we have law enforcement, U.S. Attorney's Office, everyone coming together because it truly does take a village. Our theme is unity in the community. And you can see that with the variety of teams we have playing, from PD to faith-based to community groups, the Marines are playing this year. So uh, we have a wonderful, wonderful event, all because of Thomas's idea. So being a part of this community and seeing the unity that's amongst the people is always necessary. It's, it's vital that we have unity, whether it's amongst the, the, the people that reside here, the people that uh, patrol and keep us safe here. It's important that we all have a connection so that we can build a better society for one another. That we're able to get together, unite, and you know what I mean, and just and just try to try to better our city, man. And, and, and it takes events like this. It takes stuff like this for not only for us, but for this next generation. It's just a blessing, honestly, man, and it's something that we love to do. So you see our kids coming in from different cultures, from different backgrounds, coming together to play. So one of the biggest things is about showing the diversity and showing that we can get along. And that's real major when you start talking about certain areas. This is the area that's going to be known for being able to replenish and give back to our kids. No matter how you look at this, it's about neighbors coming together, people forging strong, durable connections. All of us have become friends, so we're neighbors, we're community partners, we're friends, we're advocates, advocates for the community and for young people together and that's really what changes things. And it's just it's an inspired idea. We'd love to see this replicated across the county, across the country. I, mean, I think it's very awesome to see, you know, convicts and probation officers and officers, you know, having a good time in the community together. This is how we should be. 24 hours a day, every day, even though we know that that's not possible, but this is a strive in the right direction. This is just, this is just one of many organizations that's trying to make this world a better place.